Hi guys, welcome to this episode of Tech Tuesday. We will now be covering some important tech related news that we've collected over the last week. Like before, we'll be covering all of this within 100 seconds. Before we begin, make sure you subscribe to our channel and click on the bell icon to never miss an update from Simply Learn. Now, let's get started. First, according to a study published in the journal Scientific Reports, researchers have been able to create an AI based system that can help doctors treat traumatic brain injury or TBI. The AI would be able to predict the outcome of individual patients and provide details regarding their condition and prognosis over the course of the treatment. The system would be able to predict the probability of the patient dying within 30 days with 80 to 85 percent accuracy. Next, according to Checkpoint, a cybersecurity solutions provider, the first half of 2019 saw a 50 percent increase in attack by mobile banking malware in comparison to 2018 in India. Government data shows that the number of cybersecurity related incidents until October this year has reached about 3.13 lakhs as opposed to 2 lakhs in 2018. Checkpoint also pointed out that 80% of the attacks that happen in India come through email. Next, in an attempt to make up for the massive losses reported last month, three telecom operators in India, Vodafone India, Bharti Airtel and Reliance Geo would be hiking up their tariffs up to 42% for prepaid customers from the 3rd of December. Next, according to new research, using a technique called distributed acoustic sensing, undersea fiber optic cables can be used as seismographs. This technique would treat the fiber optic cables as a series of thousands of individual motion sensors. These cables would be able to identify the slightest movement of the surface to which they are connected to. And finally, the German parliament has passed a bill that would allow banks to sell and store cryptocurrencies effective from the 1st of January 2020. This bill would require crypto exchanges and custody providers operating in Germany to apply for a German license before 2020 ends. And there you go, tech news in 100 seconds. For more details regarding what we've covered, each of these news articles is linked in the description. Did we miss anything important? Let us know in the comment section below. If you enjoyed this video, do like and share it. And with that, we've come to the end of this episode of Tech Tuesday. This is your host Raul signing off. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for more from Simply Learn.